Living Under a Mushroom Cloud, Understanding Nuclear Deterrence. Nuclear deterrence is a scary idea. It's the belief that possessing incredibly destructive weapons can actually prevent their use. The logic is grim. If one country attacks with nuclear weapons, the other will retaliate. This would lead to unimaginable devastation for both sides. This is known as Mutually Assured Destruction, or MAD. MAD creates a stalemate. Both sides are frozen by the fear of total annihilation. It's like two people standing in a pool of gasoline, each holding a match. Neither wants to strike first, knowing it would mean their own demise. This terrifying concept has been the backbone of global security since the end of World War II. The horrific power of nuclear weapons makes their actual use unthinkable. This unthinkable scenario has, ironically, kept the peace between superpowers for decades. However, it's a fragile peace, one that requires constant vigilance and careful management. America's shield, the nuclear triad. The United States relies on a three-pronged approach to nuclear deterrence, the nuclear triad. This triad consists of intercontinental ballistic missiles, ICBMs, submarine-launched ballistic missiles, SLBMs, and strategic bombers. ICBMs are land-based missiles capable of striking targets thousands of miles away. They are housed in hardened silos underground, designed to withstand a nuclear attack. SLBMs are launched from submarines hidden deep beneath the ocean. This makes them very difficult to detect and destroy. Their survivability makes them a key part of deterrence. Finally, strategic bombers provide flexibility. They can carry both nuclear and conventional weapons. Bombers can be deployed quickly to demonstrate resolve and can be recalled if a crisis de-escalates. Together, these three elements form a credible and flexible deterrent. The triad ensures that the United States can respond to any nuclear threat anytime, anywhere. This capability underpins U.S. security commitments to allies and partners around the world. Investing in Deterrence, the 2023 Defense Budget. Maintaining a credible nuclear deterrent is expensive. The 2023 defense budget reflects this reality. It includes significant investments in modernizing all three legs of the nuclear triad. This includes upgrading existing ICBMs, developing new submarines for the SLBM force, and procuring new strategic bombers. These are not weapons of aggression. They are tools of deterrence. In a world where other nuclear-armed states are modernizing their arsenals, the United States cannot afford to fall behind. Modernization ensures that America's deterrent remains credible and effective, safeguarding peace and stability in an increasingly uncertain world. Section 4. Beyond Bombs, Diplomacy and Arms Control Nuclear deterrence is not just about weapons. It also depends on diplomacy and arms control. Treaties like the New START Treaty, which limits the number of deployed nuclear weapons, play a crucial role in reducing global risks. Diplomacy and dialogue are essential for building trust, managing crises, and preventing misunderstandings that could lead to catastrophic consequences. Military strength alone cannot guarantee security in the nuclear age. Responsible nations must work together to reduce nuclear dangers through dialogue, diplomacy, and arms control. Section 5. The Uncertain Future. New Challenges to Nuclear Deterrence. The future of nuclear deterrence is uncertain. New technologies like hypersonic missiles and cyber warfare are changing the landscape. The emergence of new nuclear powers further complicates the picture. The world must adapt to these challenges. We must strengthen international norms against nuclear weapons use. We must also find ways to reduce reliance on nuclear deterrence. This requires creative thinking and a commitment to diplomacy. The stakes could not be higher. The future of humanity may depend on our success. I urge you to learn more about these critical issues. Engage in thoughtful discussions, demand transparency from your leaders, and support organizations working for a safer world.
Our collective future depends on it.